story time about the time my friends almost drowned me <laughs> hi i have come to the realization that most of my youtube videos will probably just end up like my live streams on tiktok or whatever and there's nothing that i could do about it because i'm not emma chamberlain emma chamberlain i'm sorry if i'm butchering your name bro <laughs> i'm not funny uh so I have been wanting to share this story time for like a bit of a while. Uh, I shared it with a couple people on my live stream and I asked the people who, I asked most of the people who were in the story with me, like what happened during this time. And they were like, you know, they don't mind me sharing the story. Ugh, fuck. I'm just not going to say any names, you know? So let's just, my elbow just popped. Let's just hop right into this. Um, <laughs> basically what happened was, um, so it was like a week before my friend's birthday and she thought it was a good idea to have her birthday party at the lake and i was like a lot of the people who were like planning on coming were like hey we should do it at the cliffs because a couple of them a couple of them wanted to jump off the cliffs into the water and i was like haha i called my friend and i was like listen if they're doing it at the cliffs i'm not going because i know how childish these people are and i'm not trying to get thrown off of a cliff into water because they think it's funny you know because i knew they were going to try something right and so my friend was like yeah i'm not going either if they try to do it at the cliffs like my other friend not the one who's having the birthday party right so i was like okay and uh people who are weren't expecting to show up showed up i guess and like i was just expecting it to be close friends like people that we've known for each other for like a long time but these uh, these were also close friends you know but like i just didn't think they would actually show up because they didn't seem like they wanted to come right so they show up and i'm just like oh what's up right and we realized we didn't have any candles or a cake. So me and my friend and my other friend and the one who's also having the birthday party, I think, I think the one who's having the birthday party stayed. And me and two of my friends left to go grab cake. So we went to grab some cake. We grabbed some candles. We grabbed uh, sushi, I think, because I can't eat cakes. So I just grabbed some sushi on the way back. And we sit down. We sing happy birthday to the girl, you know, all that, you know. And after they finished singing happy birthday, some of them were like, okay, I'm going to go swimming. And I was like, I'm gonna sit here and eat my sushi because I don't know how to swim, right? I don't, I've never learned how to swim. I just never bothered learning how to swim. And I really, I should really fix that, you know? But I never just, I just never did. So I, I'm sitting there enjoying my sushi, you know, my uh, California roll. I think that's what it was. I can't remember. And um, two of the guys, three of the guys actually stand up, and one of them is on the wrestling team, and. They're a lot of, a lot bigger than me. And, you know, I wasn't even expecting these people to show up in the first place. So they stand up and they're like, you're about to get wet, Layla. And I'm just like, haha, don't play with me. And they were like, no, you're, you're about to get wet. And I'm just like, listen, I'm not, mm, I'm not doing that, you know? Please don't play any games with me. I'm really not in the mood for this. It's not funny, you know? And they're like, they start like walking towards me and getting closer to me. And I'm like, crap. I'm screwed. I was like, I get, I got to get out of here right now, right? So I run and I hide behind my best friend. And she was talking to two other people. And she was like, what's going on? And she sees them like closing in on me. And she was like, what's going on? I was like, they are trying to throw me in the lake. And I don't know how to swim, right? And she grabs me. And she goes, oh my God, let's throw her in the lake. And so I like pushed her off of me. And I took off running through the trees. And one of the guys continued to chase after me. Like he was like, like, it felt like I was being chased by a gorilla, okay? Like, this dude was big, and he was just chasing after me. And I'm, like, in my head, I'm like, fuck, 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 fuck. And I'm running, right? So I have to run through the trees and get to my brother's car because my brother was actually waiting for me. And the, the thing is, like, I promised them. I was like, hey, I got things to do later today, and so does my brother, which was my ride to the place. So I was like, I'm going to be staying till 3.30. I got to go after that, right? It was 3.45, all right? I'm running. I get to my brother's car, and um, I guess the guy, like, got tired or like slipped I don't know but he stopped chasing after me for like a second and I got away and I got to my brother's car got in the car I was like drive and he was like well I was like can you just drive and he starts driving he's like what's wrong I was like they tried to throw me in the lake and he was like what that's so fucked up I was like I know and I don't know how to swim right and so um he gets mad because something similar to that similar to that also happened to him when he was in high school or I think after he graduated high school I'm not sure I don't exactly remember the specifics of that story but he was kind of irritated so they start calling my phone over and over again and I was getting really annoyed because I was already mad to begin with that they thought it was funny to try to throw me in the lake so I put my phone on do not disturb and I just went on with my day then later on I took it off and like after like 20 minutes like on my way back home I took it off to see what happened and one of them messages me and she's like 
Layla, it's blah blah's birthday. It's not about you. It's her day today. You need to come back. And I was like, haha, yeah. Mm -hmm. It may be her birthday, happy birthday, but I'm not ready to drown. You know, that's not how I was planning on going, you know, right? So I was like, yeah, I don't care. Bye. I was just, I was so pissed. And um, I got back home and I called, one of them called me. One of the, one of the people who was there called me and I was like, that was not funny. And when I was like running, I could hear one of the girls saying, I told you guys not to do this. So like, it was like they already had this plan that they already wanted to do this to me, right? Like they already were planning on like, oh, when Layla comes back from getting her sushi, we're going to throw her in the lake, right? So um, one of them calls me and I was like, that wasn't cool, like at all, right? And he was like, everybody else was like, Layla, they were just joking with you. It was a joke. It wasn't supposed to be taken seriously. We didn't think we were actually going to run, right? And I'm just like, okay, well, it didn't seem like a joke to me. So one of them calls me and he's like, we weren't joking. And I'm like, what? He's like, we weren't joking. We were actually going to throw you in the lake and then we were going to send somebody else to like, grab you out. And I was like, that's, are you serious? And he was like, yeah, well, like he, this other guy knows how to swim very well. So we were going to throw you in and then the other guy was going to come in and pull you out. I was like, that's not funny, nor is it cool. Bye. And he was like, well, it was your friend's idea. So I get so pissed because I was like, my best friend was the one who told him to throw me in the lake. So I end the call on him and I call my best friend and I'm just like, are you dead ass right now? Like you told him to throw me in the lake. And she was like, no, I didn't. I don't know what he's talking about. And I was like, well, he's saying that you said that you guys should throw me in the lake. She was like, I have no idea. She was like, that, I never told them that. She was like, I did not know what was going on until you came running up to me and told me that they were trying to throw me in the lake. And um, before that, uh, that was like towards like the end of the day. It was like around 9 p.m., 10 p.m. when I called her. But before that, she called me and she was like, why are you mad? You know, why'd you get scared? And I'm like, why did I get scared? I don't know how to swim. What do you mean why did I get scared? I would have died, you know? And if I had died, what would y'all have done? You know, y'all would have been like, oh my God, it was just a joke. Like, I didn't think she was gonna die. Like, no, right? I was, I was so pissed that day that I literally like walked around my neighborhood for like two hours because I needed air and there was nobody to call to talk about it with because everybody that I knew was there and they all witnessed that happen and nobody tried to stop anybody, right? So I just, I haven't spoken to those people in a while. Uh, yeah. Uh, I guess we're still on good terms, but I just haven't spoken to them in a while because I don't really feel comfortable around them anymore. And um, two of the other people who were there uh, were still cool. But yeah, uh, that's the story. Uh, some of you guys, I'm pretty sure I went into detail with some of you guys while I was on live streaming, while I was live streaming on TikTok, but I never went, to, like, I never made a YouTube story about it because I feel like then I wouldn't have to repeat myself because more people would be able to view it and more people would be able to, you know, rewatch it and understand what happened. Um, but that is the story. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If y'all do like my story times, I'll be posting more story times. Usually when I'm on live, I'm, like, more like, but... I have family over right now, like my little sisters are downstairs and my cousin's also downstairs and I'm not trying to be very loud. So that's why I'm not, you know, because usually I'm just like, and then, you know, but not right now. Uh, that's it. That's the story time. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's more that happened, but I don't think that is any of y'all's business. Uh, thank you for watching my YouTube video. I hate, I hate this. Hey, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, goodbye. Ha <laughs> ha.